Hey guys, Brandon here, back for another Pokemon Wi-Fi battle in the Sun and Moon era. Um, I was struggling to find battles, so I decided to jump to the battle, the plaza, and search up random people who were accepting battles. So it could be interesting because they pro some of them might not have like battle-ready teams. Some of them might not have like any like legitimate teams, which is, I mean, it, it won't be that interesting. I'm taking a shot here. Hopefully, their team isn't like bad. So. I can at least have a decent battle on the channel here. And this is the team I will be using. I'm using Choice Bandit 2 Cannon. Of course, it does have Skill Link. Um, it's got Bullet Seed, Rock Blast, I believe Return, and Brave Bird. I do have Garchomp, which is a Swords Dance set with Fire AMZ for Fire Fang to deal with Steel to, to Steela. Assault Vest Magazone as my switch to the top with Lele, for spec at least. Uh, Drizzle Pelipper with Damp Rock. And I do have Z Moves, Kingdra with Z Splash. So I am going for the plus three in the rain. For attack so it's gonna be interesting if I can pull that off um, let's go ahead and fight in the team skull boss team which is of course Guzma I think everyone's like favorite part of the soundtrack I think from what I've seen but anyway this is Mackenzie a passerby I guess you can you can call it now or I mean I guess that's what they are now I guess or they're still called that I don't know but anyway it is kind of annoying when people have their uh, <laughs> they'll have the um, on their, their profile to say accepting battle trip request at any time then you send the request and then they decline it which is kind of you know makes you sad but anyway we'll see what this uh person decides to do um if i see an in-game team i'll probably stop recording uh to, to be honest but if, if i see a decent team I'll, I'll keep going but you know i just want to get good battles out there i'm trying to grind trying to get some uh get some uh what, what was that word what's that word Try to bulk record some of these. Maybe about three or four today, so I can have them up for the couple of days. Because I am going to be um, unavailable next week for uploads Wednesday through Saturday. Um, but we'll see what they're doing here. It looks like they're struggling, or maybe they're just like thinking, "Why the heck did I sign up for this battle?" Right? Um, but yeah, it's a pretty interesting team. I haven't tried it out yet. I haven't got a chance to yet, at least. Uh, of course, a lot of these teams have issues, but I mean, pre-Poke Bank is kind of fun still because not all of the threats are out there just yet. So some mons can shine, um, you know, before other stuff come out. So we're waiting to see what this person's doing. We're probably gonna end up DCing here. Um, I would cut it until they get back, but there's a lot of cutting on my part. I don't want to mess up the audio and stuff like that. Um, okay, again, again, there is no the webcam just because it's a lot easier to record this way. Um, cause I don't have to set up the green screen or the lights and then I'm just going to get all war and then it just gets, you know, it just becomes a lot more tedious than it should be. So anyway, this is also helps me get my audio a bit more clear and I don't, I don't have to worry about, you know, the desyncing of the webcam or anything like that. So, um, but yeah, I apologize for the wait. If I end up uploading this battle, then of course, um, then well, it'll be uploaded. Here we go. Finally got it done. Let's see what they have. I, I assume it's not a good team if they're just sitting around, but we'll see here as there is actually um, some stuff. Must be a battle spot team or because uh, there's three mods and no items, but it, I mean, for most of the beast and, you know, and all that stuff. So I kind of want to leave two cannon here. Alternatively, Pelipper is a really good lead. Yeah, I'll leave Pelipper here so I can just U-turn out. Um... Kingdra might be able to do some work. I don't think Kingdra's going to be able to outspeed the Faramosa at plus one or plus two. Because I am adamant. But I'm going to assume it's not an EV trained Faramosa. Or like IV trained or like reset. So we'll see. Hopefully this battle is interesting. And I can upload it. But this is again, this is kind of an interesting battle anyway. My Pelipper as they end up leading with the Incineroar. Not bad. I'm going to immediately U-turn. If they have an Electro-type move, then I've been fooled. But I'm definitely going for the U-turn. It should outspeed me. Um, so, yeah, I'm just going to U-turn here. Let's see. Um, it's actually out to Darkest Laureat. Okay. Uh, let's see how much this does. I am, like, max defense. So that actually just bounced off. I'm not sure if I want to go for the Kingdra sweep now. I think I want to go for it. Let's do it. Let's see what happens, guys. Let's go for it. 
I, I should be able to take a, 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 a one of those darkest moves again. Z splash here, of course. Z splash. If you guys, if you guys don't know, if you if you have the normal Z item, the normal M Z, it gives you a, a plus three boost to attack. So it's pretty much half a belly jump plus three. It's like a tail globe for attack. It's really, really, it's really cool. I hope it works out. Of course, my speed is doubled in the rain. So I'm essentially just a freaking beast. This outrage is actually the move. Uh oh, I do live. I do live, which is fantastic. I figured I could because of the non-stab. So. Uh, let me see if they have any priority on the team. Um, looks like they do not have any priority. And I can just go for Waterfall here. Uh, Decidueye is kind of an issue because I only have Outrage in return as my other two moves. Because Iron Head's not available. Uh, I don't have to click Outrage though, which is annoying. Um, I don't want to click out Outrage, which is... I, I know it doesn't get Shadow Sneak. It does get Sucker Punch, though. Uh, I'm going to try to bank on the fact it doesn't have it. I'm honestly... I'm going to see if Waterfall can kill it. I mean, I really do. I just doubt it. But I'm, I'm going to check because I'm just curious and see if it can do it. Plus three attack. It is adamant nature. Waterfall. I mean, obviously, I'm going a little... I'm going a little insane here, but I, I don't know. It actually has a shot to Oko. I'm going for it. I'm going for it. It actually has a chance to Oko. A kill! There we go! I mean, let's be real here. Uh, it might not have any EVs. But then again, it would be on my offensive set. So I'm assuming it would be just like 4 in Spadef or 4 in defense. So it, it does. It was a 56% chance to Oko. Assuming they don't have 4 EVs in defense. But yeah, I outspeed everything. I just sweep everything. Oh my goodness, man. Call this the pasture by sweep. That's what you gotta call this. I'll speed this no matter what. I am time I have my speed is doubled. I have I have like five or six turns left of rain. This game is over. I, I'm gonna upload this because I can call it pasture by sweep. I, I'm gonna go ahead and call it that. That's what I'll call it here. Uh this will be just like a fun video. This won't be like anything serious, you know. Um I got to pull this off. Uh decidui. Yeah, so, I mean, regardless if the Decidueye was trained or not, I mean, arguably, if it was an in-game Decidueye, it would have taken it better because his EVs would have been all, mag you know, mushed up and stuff. Uh, Pelipper will definitely tank this, though, so I think I might have to go for Outrage now. Oh, actually, I do have the, um, I do have Return on this thing, just as a, a move to hit stuff. Um, return should be able to knock it out. Um, actually, no, it just bounces off, actually. Uh... Oh, return does nothing. I'm adamant, too. This is crazy. I mean, assuming it's max defense. Waterfall actually does around almost the same amount as return, honestly. Outrage should be able to knock it out. Um, I could go for the three-turn Outrage and just try to win it here. But, um... Let me see if I have a fairy type. I I'll go for it if I have to. Yeah. Nah, I think I'll just go for the Outrage here and attempt to win the game like this. Go for three-turn Outrage or Breakthrough Confusion. I'll break the confusion. You know me. My, my moms are well trained. So can we pull off the sweep? At this point, it's not about winning. It's about pulling off the 6-0 right here. Assuming they don't leave. Assuming. They probably will, though. There's really no reason not to leave at this point. Crobat does come out. Uh, of course, I do have one more turn. If I get three turns, of course, it is for sure going to be the sweep. If not, then um, maybe next time. Shouldn't have accepted my battle, huh? <laughs> but don't worry, I'll definitely use this either in a showdown live or another Wi-Fi battle, just because it is on, this doesn't really get the full uh, showcase. Oh, I got the three-turn, yes. So that is for sure the 6-0, three-turn outrage. Again, King Drew doing work. Uh, I mean, once it gets Iron Head in, in the next gen, I'll probably run that over Return. Because Return doesn't really do anything. And of course, it doesn't get anything like Dragon Claw or anything like that. So Outrage is the only like form of like Dragon Stab that's actually sort of reliable. But that is going to be the sweep, Kingdra, the beast, sweeping through everything in the rain. Swift sweep in the rain. Hope you guys enjoyed the sweep. Uh, yeah, I'll be back for a legitimate battle another time. I mean, that wasn't that was a legitimate battle, but I'll be back for a competitive battle <laughs> against you know someone who has like you know. Like I said, it wasn't a bad battle. It's just 
Obviously, there was issues with my sweeping team. But anyway, you get the point. It was a sweep. Hope you guys enjoyed. I'll be back next time. Peace.